graphs here what are all the basic graphs in mathematics here what i need to understand perfectly here so there are around seven uh, variety of fourier graphs here i need to understand its behavior here how it moves here so if i understood the behavior of those graphs here i can interpret many graphs very easily okay so now let's start with our basic graphs concept here so graph number one it's a linear function here keep remember whenever the word linear comes here it is always in the form of what here straight line keep remember it's what here straight line so what f of x is equal to what here the algebraic interpretation is what here ax plus b so any so system of equation in the form or any polynomial in the form f of x equal to ax plus b is always a reprints what here a linear function keep remember with the power degree equal to what here one okay so linear function nothing but it's a straight line so not maybe of this kind here it's of the term y is equal to mx plus uh, c something here it may be your a horizontal line or vertical line or it might be line line um, kind, might be like anything here linear nothing but which moves in a straight line that would that is enough here second kind of function here which is very important here square function here Square function is always of the category parabolic type here. Keep remember student here. So many students remember only the curve of y is equal to x square. So if I say y is equal to x square, they will interpret this graph here. If I say y is equal to x raised to 4, y is equal to x raised to 6 or y is equal to x raised to 10, it's not possible for them to draw here. So remember student here. So x raised to 4 I can write as x square of square here. x cube I can write here. x cube of square here. Also x raised to 10 I can write x to the 4 of pi to the four, uh, sorry, x to the x raised to 5 to the power of 4 here 2. All curves are what here? Square function only. So x raised to 4 is also of this kind here. Remember, if somebody asks you to draw y is equal to x raised to 4, y is equal to x raised to 4, again it is the parabolic shape only. Okay. Y is equal to x raised to 6, again it is this shape only. X is 10, so 11, 12. Y is equal to key remember x to the power of 4 here 2 win. So is always what here? This shape only. Key remember students here, wherein belongs to integer. So square function function key primary here all square functions are of parabolic shape here so all square functions are key primary they are what kind of function even function even function and they are symmetrical about y axis here so somebody has given the graph for you to test whether it is so uh, square function or not here somebody has mentioned this graph here so what kind of function it is it simply say don't say y is equal to x square so i never mentioned its value here you simply say it's a square function the reason is so i am getting first point the minimum point minimum value is there minimum so and one more is symmetrical about what here y x is there so based on this hint here we can say easily it's what here square function here and so keep remember i said here so y is equal to x raised to 2n uh, so where n belongs to positive integer always all kind of category comes under this parabolic shape only so now property number so sorry graph number three is a cube function here y is equal to x cube y is equal to x cube it's a cube function right okay i said in the my pre previous session here okay so y is equal to x cube or sometime y is equal to x raised to what here any odd odd curve say okay, say y is equal to x cube or y is equal to power of 2n plus 1 i can say 2n plus 1 don't say is it only sometime y is equal to f of x to x comes it's a linear function here i am saying 2n plus 1 here so y is equal to x raised to 5 or y is equal to x raised to 7 y is equal to x raised to 9 any kind would be of this shape only keep remember here whenever so y is equal to somebody will tell you to draw y is equal to x raised to 5 definitely it is of this kind x raised to 7 same category x raised to 9 same x raised to so 1 x raised to 1 not 1 definitely of this category only key up member students here okay so now next property so square root function here okay we'll be having what here we'll be going through here square root function okay so the f of x square root x this like what here this guy same like uh, it's like little like exponential curve here f of x is equal to what here root x here okay keep remember student here so not only uh, root x here somebody ask you draw root 2x graph here root 3x root 5x so root 6x anything might be there of there of the word here same shape only keep remember it's a basic so shape here so sometimes the question is of the type f of x is equal to f of root 2x is there root 2x okay whether it is 1 1 or not so question might be thing here so to draw 1 1 we go with what here so horizontal line test here if so definitely it passes uh, it cuts at only one point here it's a 1 1 here so root 3x or root 5x root 6x here so all will be having the word here the same format only the appearance of the graph is what here always same key primary function here the square root function here square root 2x 3x 4x 5x 
so any x here so now graph number so uh, phi here so phi safe curve here phi safe one is equal to y is equal to x plus x other is y is equal to minus x it is having over here two straight line so at intersecting at one point here this kind of graph we say over here absolute value function or what here modulus function here okay so it may be y is equal to mod 2x or mod 3x or mod 5x mod 6x any mod function we is always of the what here phi set category key frame brackets here so now so sixth one is what here reciprocal function here one upon x here so y f of x is of the form what here one by x so all reciprocal function here key frame brackets here so all reciprocal function one by x one by two x one by three x one by five x even so this kind of function always in this in this safe only you will be having what here two loops here it will keep remember here i am drawing this kind of category here it will never touch y axis and here it will never touch what here x axis so here it never touch what here y axis these are we say asymptotes so they will never so we say they will meet at infinity practically it is what here impossible so remember kids here so straight line a linear function parabolic shape a square function so this kind of category is a little uh, say type if we say the q function so uh, the it's a rocket of function is called what here square root function and phi set category we say what here modulus function and reciprocal function so you will be having what here two leap so you can draw 1 by 2x or 1 by 3x or 1 by 5x anything can be of the same, same shape here so we'll study lot many uh, session on this graph part here how to draw y is equal to uh, f of x to 1 by x cube x raised to 5 we'll see in my next session here okay so we'll go with one uh, a small mo uh, one more concept now uh, uh, property number 7 sorry graph number 7 is a logarithm function here so it it again what here it's like uh, this one only it it meets x axis at the point what here 1, 0 why so uh, if i put x equal to 1 log 1 value is what here is 0 keep remember students here it will not it will not touch y axis here y axis is what here it's an asymptotes for log for here so uh, log 2x log 3x log 4x so remember this what here the basic result here this is same only okay so y is equal to e raised to x both are what here inverse to each other here y is equal to e raised to exponential function again it cuts that point what here 0 comma 1 here so uh, keep remember students here this guy will never 